Hello friends, welcome to Insights Again Initiative. In today's video, we are going to discuss about rat hole mining in the context of the recent tunnel collapse in Uttarakhand. So now let's see what is this rat hole mining and what are the other techniques we are going to discuss here. Mainly here we are going to discuss about what this project is all about and why we are deploying the rat hole mining now and where is this rat hole mining is very prevalent. Those are the issues we are going to cover. But anyhow, let me introduce the detailed video components of this video. In this video, we are going to discuss about why it is in news, why we are discussing about this rat hole mining and this uh, agar mission, what is this agar mission, how it works, all these things we are going to discuss. Then how this tunnel collapsed, what are the possible causes and where this tunnel is constructing and it is connecting which two areas that we will discuss and what is the length of this tunnel and what is the significance of this tunnel and what is the you know like significance of Chadam project that we will discuss then we will discuss about horizontal agar mission which is failed now because of that we finally go I mean choose in the this rat hole mining what is this rat hole mining what are the environmental and safety concerns regarding the rat hole mining and finally in this end of this video we will discuss about the NDRF because NDRF forces they are trying to you know like uh, rescue they are trying to rescue these workers okay whoever trapped in that first let me explain the context here we are discussing about a tunnel students here we are discussing a tunnel that is Silkaira barcode tunnel the first thing is the tunnel name is Silkaira barcode tunnel this is the name of the tunnel we are discussing and it is a part of the Chardam project okay and it is a bidirectional tunnel this basic information you have to know it is present in Uttarakhand Uttarakashi district the length of this tunnel is 4.531 kilometers like I mentioned it is a part of the Chardam project it is on the Yamunotri national highway these are the some of the basic details regarding the tunnel now let's see what happened in this tunnel this tunnel got collapsed this tunnel got collapsed the either direction and workers got trapped in this tunnel now from one end NDRF authorities they started drilling drilling through this tunnel by sending I mean through this drilling the center pipe okay through that pipe they keep on drilling and they are sending the pipe through that pipe obviously whoever the workers they will be you know like uh, get out of this collapsed one by using the stretchers so NDRF people they will bring out these people outside that is the idea actually but after traveling to certain distance whatever this drilling machine what this machine is known as agar machine this agar machine it got stuck it got stuck after it went into certain certain limits why because now let me explain imagine this is the tunnel and here here okay here workers got stuck workers got stuck now this is the collapsed part collapsed part of this tunnel okay collapsed part now what happens friends in this collapsed part here here especially this whatever this uh, tunnel concrete whatever the concrete we used that concrete sink to here that means the machine came up to this the machine came up to this after reaching this area after this after reaching this area the machine got stuck now what happens they try to get this machine parts out that uh, you know debris and everything now now NDRF people they are sending humans into here they use the deep you know like a rat hole mining so that they try to go through this so they will they will make holes through those holes and these people will get rescued so here this entire thing involves part of you know like agar machine agar machine after traveling certain distance it got stuck then we deployed the a rat hole a rat hole 
माइनिंग सो हियर वी आर डिप्लॉइंग टू टेक्निक्स ओके अगर मिशन इज अ वेरी फ्रीक्वेंटली विल यूज इन कंस्ट्रक्शन ऑफ लॉट ऑफ यू नो लाइक कैनाल्स एंड टनल्स एंड ऑल दिस थिंग दिस अगर मिशन एंड द डीप होल दिस रैट होल टनल रैट होल माइनिंग रैट होल माइनिंग आर वेरी सिंपल स्टूडेंट्स रैट होल माइनिंग इज नथिंग बट इफ दिस इज ए दिस एन एरिया वेर यू नो लाइक यू नो लाइक अंडरग्राउंड अंडरग्राउंड underground coal is available then people will they make a hole okay this hole is sufficient for one person the the people will dig the hole till they get the coal coal here and once they find coal they will get this coal out it is a like kind of how these rats and how these uh, you know like uh, nocturnal animals some of them arboreals the animals which uh, which make burrows in the soil how they dig inside so in that way they will make this kind of tunnels even the honey badgers these are animals they will make tunnels the same way these people also they make this kind of holes and through that holes they will bring the coal this is the rat hole okay a rat hole mine okay now we deploying agar mission up to certain level later this rat hole mining will be done once the once it reached to this this workers then they will get rescued this is the total idea now in this context we are going to discuss about various aspect of this particular disaster it this is related to the gs paper 3 syllabus mapping disaster management disaster and disaster management why it is in news 41 workers trapped in the silkiara barkoch tunnel which collapsed and one of the major setback to this rescue operation was the the breakdown of the agar mission in the last two days that cutting mission that that mission struck inside that tunnel it was brought out and we are deploying the planning to drill through the rest of this debris through the practice of rat hole mining this is the idea just now i explained rat hole mining is a technique primarily used for the extraction from horizontal as well as narrow seams it can be used to extract the coal from the coal seam and generally this method is quite popular in area such as meghalaya where the local people uses this technique to extract coal of course it is banned by ngd national green tribunal and of, during the rainy season this technique is in even causing flooding in the coal areas uh, and that is the reason it is a disastrous i mean dangerous and in terms of the disaster also it is very highly disastrous however it is it is essential to highlight the term rat hole rat hole mining is typically unregulated hazardous and illegal mining which is prevalent in the north east states of meghalaya this project this tunnel already told you this tunnel is a part of the chardam project chardam project main purpose is to encourage the regional connectivity so that socio economic development of the region will be improved chardam includes badrinath and kedarnath gangotri yamunotri these are the four places uh, chardam and what are the possible causes of failure it may be due to the loose patch of the rock when the rock is obviously very loose patch water will seep into the rock so rock will get collapse it may lead to the collapse of the tunnel chardam project it is a two lane highway project constructed in the uttarakhand district by bro chardam includes these four places it's a part of the national highway 125 which is a part of the kailash manasarovar yatra route this is the broader uh, you know like picture of this particular project horizontal agar mission the horizontal agar mission it is a specialized tool to create horizontal tunnels it consists of rotated blades like we discussed like we have seen in the previous image and which is attached to the central shaft rotating blades which is attached to the central shaft like this rotating blade attached to the central shaft it digs it digs horizontally as it is digging as it is going further it will bring that debris back in the form of the fluid so that fluid even it helps in cooling of the mission as well there is a working mechanism this fluid serves as a lubricant to cool off this you know like uh, that rotating heads the agar mission the front one it keep on rotates and it will go towards the horizontal way and here hydraulic or mechanical systems power this rotation 
generally hydraulic will be used and as this agar mission is got stuck and it is not working now we took out this mission now we are deploying the rat hole mining rat hole mining refers to extracting the coal by using horizontal seams narrow horizontal seams it is prevalent in state like meghalaya rat hole refers to narrow pits dug into the ground and once these pits are dug these miners they go inside using ropes or bamboo ladders to reach the coal seams and they extract that coal using primitive tools such as shovels pickaxes and baskets two main types of rat hole mining one type of rat hole mining generally you will observe on the the slopes of the mountain because here the thin nature of the seam so that coal can be uh, can be extracted very quickly with the less work box cutting procedure box cutting procedure is like this first one horizontal cut will be made then after the horizontal cut is done then once they find that coal seam then they'll go to the vertical vertical so digging so that they can extract the coal environmental and safety concerns regarding the rat hole mining rat hole mining is typically unregulated and because of the poor ventilation and because of the lack of structural support it is hazardous in nature even it may also leads to deforestation and land degradation and water pollution even during the monsoon season it may leads to flooding as well despite attempts by authorities to regulate or ban such kind of practices still it is prevalent due to the economic factors of the people in this region mainly their livelihoods are very limited in nature that is the reason still people are going for this kind of rat hole mining when it was banned it was banned by ngt in 2014 and it is continued to be banned ngt observed this as there are number of there are number of cases where because of this rat hole mining the rainy season it is causing water flooding in the mining areas that resulted to death of the individual including the employees as well as the workers this order was in connection to meghalaya where this practice is very prevalent now ng ndrf ndrf works i mean enter into this tunnel collapse and they are trying to rescue the people this ndrf created in 2006 according to the disaster management act 2005 so it is a statutory backup mandate a tasked with responding to natural as well as the man made disasters it may include the cyclones earthquakes or industrial accident like bhopal gas incident and it works under the this ndrf works under the chairmanship of prime minister prime minister led the ndrf now let's see mcq yesterday's video mcq the consider the following statements the high court exercise jurisdiction over the subordinate judiciary in the state right 42nd constitution amendment 1976 empowered the parliament to make laws for the creation of all india judicial services right both 1 and 2 both 1 and 2 next today's main question explain the concept of rat hole mining prevalent in meghalaya and its association with unregulated coal extraction practices discuss the environmental and safety concern associated with this methods what are the environmental and safety concerns regarding this rat hole mining this is today's main question now as we reach to the end of this video we will do quick revision in this video we discussed about where is this tunnel and this tunnel is a part of which project what are the reasons for the tunnel collapse after the collapse what kind of methods we used a uh, hydraulic agar mission as well as the rat hole mining and what is this rat hole mining in which condition it will be employed and ndrf and ndrf mandate so these are the these are the topics we discussed and this is the detailed analysis regarding the rat hole mining